Hey guys, in this video we will see how to get a list of installed applications on Android. You can see I have run the app in the port emulator. On the left hand, you can see the emulator is running on Android 10 that is API level 29. On the right, it is Android 11 that is API level 30. So here you have noticed that we didn't got all the application names on the Android 11 so in this video we will discuss why this is happening and how to uh, resolve this and hopefully at the end you will get all the installed application names on Android 11 also so let's jump into the coding so for simplicity I have already developed the list view on the array adapter now just uh, create a method that will just insert the all the app names into the list view so that method will be set app names to list view so now just implement this method of private void So what we do now is just create a intent with action main and with category launcher. So let me just create that first. So now we will get our package manager and run our query using this intent. Let me do that. Package manager dot query intent activities and we will provide our intent and of course a flag that will be zero. So what this query intent activity return is it just return the list of resolve info objects. So we will cast that here with the list of So these all infos so what is this list of resolve info objects so here each resolve info object will will be the package information of each app installed in our phone so we just we will now look through that uh, resolve info list and we will get um, each application name through that resolve info object so what I'm doing is just looping through the resolve info list that we got here so now we will just add each app name to our app names array list let me do that app names dot add and info object dot activity info dot load label we will provide get package manager and finally to string so this line of code will return will retrieve the application name from the resolve info object so and finally we will inform our list view that the data has changed so for that adapter dot notify data is changed so let's just run on api level 29 and see what happens and yeah here we got all the 
list of installed applications and this is IP level 29 that is Android 10 now run it on Android 11 and finally we get only two app names on Android 11 and now you can see only two of them were shown on Android 11 that's because Android 11 introduced a new thing called package visibility filters and that just don't allow querying packages in Android 11 and we are doing it here so what will be the solution for this and the solution for this is we want to add a query element on the manifest so let me just add that let me just open Android manifest and here we want to add queries so inside this query we want to provide each and every package names we want to query so in our case we don't know every package name so we got help here with the intent filter either we can provide the exact package names using package or you can provide intent filter using intent so we will use intent here so now we will give a action main hopefully this action main will be there on every app out there so this intent filter will match every application so let me just run this and show you and yeah here you can see the all the names of installed applications and this is it for now if you want to videos like this please do subscribe if you don't want to subscribe at least give us a like that will help me to grow okay thank you